Hi everyone, welcome back to your coffee break with Chinese Pod. I'm Alice. Hi everyone, I'm Josh. 欢迎回到中文播客 In this lesson, we are going to teach you four ways to politely ask for something. 在中国的公司里，你常常需要同事的帮忙。如果说话礼貌一点，可以给人好的印象，同事也比较想要帮你。我们之前学过，请。今天我们来看看，除了“请”以外，有什么句子可以说。我们开始吧。When it comes to asking for favors in the workspace, knowing some language etiquette can sometimes help you get what you want. What are some words and phrases in Chinese that we can use to come across more sincerely when it comes to general requests?、Mm-hmm. 当你想请别人帮忙的时候，除了“请”以外，还有一个很重要的词，就是不好意思。嗯，不好意思 is excuse me, right?、Mm-hmm. And this is generally put before the general request. 没错。那有什么事情你想请别人帮忙的？嗯 ，How about could you take notes on today's meeting? 嗯，请你记录一下这次的会议。所以整句话是不好意思，请你记录一下这次的会议。Mm, as simple as that. You also can add the word "trouble." Trouble means trouble, so to trouble someone in doing something. Or is trouble, you trouble someone. Can be replaced, can be replaced, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Because it's very similar to trouble,、mm-hmm. but trouble in this phrase means. Labor,、mm-hmm. so to trouble someone to do something laboriously,、mm-hmm. very similar to your law. 嗯，没错，或者是拜托你了。嗯，拜托 simply means please. 所以整句话是不好意思，请你记录一下这次的会议，麻烦你了。When it comes to asking your boss to review something, there is a term that is very useful.、Mm-hmm. Hello. We are so glad that you're enjoying this video so far, but you're not getting the full lesson here. The full lesson and the rest of this video are available on our site, ChinesePod.com. Give it a try and see how much more we have to offer. We have exercises, expanded examples, vocabulary, and downloadable material. You cannot get that here on YouTube. So visit our website today. Enter Grace as the promo code and get 20% off our premium subscriptions. I'll see you at ChinesePod.com. But hurry! Only the first 300 subscribers are allowed to redeem this deal. Use promo code Grace for 20% off your entire premium subscription and launch your real learning experience. ChinesePod, ChinesePod. 